Hello, collective. Welcome back to the channel. So, water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpios. This is what you need to be aware of in the next for the next seven days. Okay, let's go ahead and get into this read. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families. As always, I return to source. I return to sender. All negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. Okay. I call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energy. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled, being dismantled as we speak. And so I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Okay, so water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This is what you need to be aware of. This could be something that's going on uh, in the background of you. But in the next seven days, there's something going on where it's like someone knows the truth now. And the person that knows the truth is having some type of rude awakening. And then the person that is going through the heartbreak is the one that the truth is known about. So let's say you have a woman that has been carrying herself as something that she's not. She's out here having some type of emotional outburst because a man knows the truth about her now. How you come into play in this situation is that whoever this is that knows the truth about a queen of wands or whoever this is now wants to come towards you to give to you, share it with you you may want to be also on the lookout that this queen of wands is desperate out here to hold on to a man block two people from meeting maybe paying people out here paying someone out here to block you two from meeting okay so now that this man know one she's not genuine she's not a healer she's not gifted there's someone that's been out here very uh, pretending to be something that they are not uh, they're also finding out that she's not someone exclusive. This is someone that likes to have options, men and women. This is someone very toxic and karmic. This is someone that pretends to be every queen in the deck, but she is not. This is not someone that's disciplined. Uh, everything you can think of when it comes to an empress, this woman is the opposite of it. This woman does not exemplify any of the queens in the decks in the upright, okay? And this has her burden because now someone knows the truth and she's not able to pretend to be something she's not there's some type of lie she may have told about another woman that you know everything she is she projected onto a queen of source you could be the queen of source so she would have told either a community a company a masculine or someone else that you are extremely disingenuous you are not a healer you're not in touch with your inner child you're out here pretending to be something you're not you're not genuine you're very karmic toxic and a liar so they're finding out now that everything she has been saying or everything she and her friends and families have been saying about you is all lies you are someone in the upright Okay, and the, the truth, maybe you have said or you living in your truth is bringing some type of balance in this situation. And they may have this woman and a group of people trapped in their mind because now they know like the gag is the gig is up. The gag is the gig is up. Uh, someone could have been doing a lot of mental manipulations behind the scenes. Yeah, absolutely. A lot of manip mental manipulations behind the scenes at what at work and when it comes to someone's work as well so if you have a business you've been working on someone has been paying for a lot of manipulations to be done on that so if you have a a, a, a product you've been selling that was doing very well this will be one of the idiots that'll go and uh you know order some of your products just to, so they can leave like bad reviews or even they don't use the product they will go out and leave bad reviews so they can say that your product does not work you're lying to people you're misleading your people uh, people and that they use your product it broke out their skin uh, blah 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 something like that that she's been doing okay if you have like a platform this is someone that's paying someone behind the scenes to temper with your platform play with your numbers and things like that if someone has been doing quite a lot behind the scenes regardless of everything she's done the truth has still come out and she's still heartbroken because there's a masculine out here now that is self-actualizing has foresight that this woman is one disingenuine this is not someone that is as eccentric she wants to be seen as someone that's eccentric someone that's exotic that there's some type of je ne sais quoi about her there's you see the freaking page of cups is out here in the re reverse 
There is nothing je ne sais quoi about this woman. There's nothing unique, eccentric, or nothing. Someone could be very beautiful, but that's about it. This is someone for the community. Someone likes to have options is what I'm being told with the devil out here. And someone is nothing but a liar. Okay. It could be a queen of wands. She's been showing up a lot as someone that's been trying to force some type of image. She wants to be seen as someone that's orthodox, someone that's religious. She's not religious. This is someone that pretends to be religious and it has backfired horribly. So this is really how you come into the scenario is that maybe the truth may be brought to your attention that someone has been out here pretending to be you pretending to be something they're not and they've been trying to cause still midst to your options and things like that block people from giving you options block people from communicating with you this is a woman that's been sneaking you you could be the actual genuine queen of cups that's very disciplined wise knowing oh my gosh the high priestess justice car Oh gosh, and the higher fin empress. Listen, higher fin empress and the magician, baby. Someone don't have to run with the wrong energy. You got a whole high priestess justice car out here, a person out here with the higher fin and the freak. Oh my gosh, the magician. Someone barked up the wrong tree, is what she is finding out. She barked up the wrong tree and now she may be wishing. Yeah, she's wishing to take some type of action to cause you some type of distress. Sees you as the queen of wands as well. So she may have some type of attraction to you. And that's something. <laughs> Someone don't like you because what? I don't even know how to verbalize this. It says she don't like you. Because people see you as wish fulfillment, but she wants to be you and she has a crush on you. What the heck? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Uh -uh. I can't. Like, this woman does nothing but self-sabotage and is under judgment. May want to come towards you to have some type of, I'm so sorry for doing this, blah, 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 blah. It's a girl, who you, you, you need to stay where you are. Who are you coming to? Like, if she was coming to you to apologize, this is you. Like, mm, 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 you, you stay over there. Keep away from me. I don't want nothing from you. Because why? She's coming with some type of ulterior motive. There's something about, like, the uh, moon, like, like the moon ritual. Someone does rituals behind the scenes. Goes to, like, practitioners. This is not someone gifted. With that pitch of cups out here in the reverse, this woman is not gifted in any way, shape, or form. This is someone that pretends to be gifted. Okay? And here it is that things are being brought, things are being put into balance for you. Like, the wheel is moving in the four, fourth right uh, direction. Karma is balancing. Excuse me. Karma is balancing itself out as it always does. Whether it's moving forward, backwards, it's still balancing itself out. So things are going in the right direction for you and things are kind of digressing for this woman because this is the energy she put out. It's like someone was expecting things to go their way and it's not going her way. So there's some type of clarity that has been brought to... I'm telling you, she's disappointed out here. This is her and her group of friends and families. They are disappointed out here. Okay, so your clarity, maybe you're someone very intellectual, very intuitive and gifted. You may know about all the illusions these people have been causing. Your ancestors have been feeding you the information. So you have a higher knowledge of some type of betrayal that has been being plotted against you and maybe someone else. Maybe trying to cause some type of still mix and present, prevent some type of new beginning from taking place. Um, but is that you're too strong? Is that what I'm telling you? You're too strong. Like someone knows the truth about you now that you are an actual emperor. So they may be coming in to extend some type of friendship to balance things out in your life or in the situation. Um, but your strength has been the problem for these, this friend, these friends, these, this group of people, this family, whatever this is, but Sagittarius just what, what the heck Sagittarius down here. Water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpios, just know that the universe is balancing things out. Like with the wheel out here followed by the uh, um, the temperance card, the universe is attuning, is bringing attunement into this situation. There's something you spoke out into the universe that's, uh, that's 
that put something into gear, like balance, karma, playing out. So there's some type of balance being brought into this situation. Maybe there's a Sagittarius man or woman that may be coming towards you to maybe amend things because I see like it's going from like distress, turmoil, heartache, heartbreak to what? Attunement, reconciliation, balance, healing, teamwork. So there is some type of change taking place between you and another party. Um, whereas things are kind of digressing for the other party. So think of it as like one kingdom is falling and the rightful kingdom is rising. Uh, so there's a change in energy. You're going, or the both of you are going from, from being at a distance. Okay, and then you're coming together and there will be some type of amendment going on, basically. Okay, but while this is going on, there's someone that's wanting to cause hindrances uh, behind the scenes. And this could be a queen of wands. Like she wants to force someone to be in a relationship with her. And it's a no, because it's that anything she's offering this man is a no, because he... He's not sure about her anymore. He does, he's not sure he wants to have a family with her. He's not sure he wants to get married, be committed. Uh, you know, just, I don't know what it is. He does not want to be in a commitment with this woman because some type of truth has been revealed and there's something she's been trying for a long time to hide and prevent him from seeing. So I listen, I don't know what to tell her, but you're going to have to go and find yourself like, some type of sugar daddy somewhere else because I think that's how she saw this man as a sugar daddy, not as a lover. Okay. Dang, 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 dang. So a sister's out here crying because she was not able with the tower in the reverse. That means that she was not able to stop someone from two people from meeting. Like they're still going to meet in divine timing. These two are still going to meet what it is. Why this heart, uh, three of sources out here is because they have been doing a lot behind the scenes to block two people from meeting, but they are still meeting. There's nothing they can do to stop this because the universe has taken over at this point with the wheel of fortune out here, followed by the temperance. The universe has taken over this situation. It's that whatever they're plotting, all the betrayals and things like that, interferences, it's not happening. So they can cry all they want. She and the group of friends behind the scenes, she can cry, they can cry, blood, tear, whatever they want. But this tower that they were trying to invoke between two people is not happening. When they meet in divine timing, it's still going to be a peaceful energy. This, I'm telling you, it's going to be a peaceful energy and they can, you know, keep being out here in that woe is me energy, but you knew what you was getting into when you started coming after someone else trying to block their finances, resources, and everything. Okay. I don't know what this is. It's like also like there was a man trying to work with a woman for a long time and she kept pretending like she had stopped doing something, but she was still doing it. Maybe he's just now finding out that she has still been coming after a queen of cups that don't put us into this chapter a long time ago and has moved on with their life. Like a man is finding out that a woman has been lying the whole time, pretending like she had let something go when actually in reality, she had people doing things on her behalf. They were doing things on her behalf and reporting back to her. So the whole time he thought that she had stopped doing something never did. Okay. Never did. So anyways, Queen of Cups, you're putting an end to this chapter, um, successfully completing this chapter and having a brand new passion and beginning in life. Someone may be uh, having some type of, I don't know what this is, remorse, feeling embarrassed. This could be the Queen of Wands because this is over. She and everything these people have been doing is over. What is, who is this King of Swords? Yeah... There's something that's going to be brought to your attention. There is something that's going to be brought to your attention. Okay. Uh, I'm going to, yeah, you're definitely like a queen of cups. This may pertain to, you could be a masculine or feminine energy, but water signs, that is your reading. This is what you should be looking forward to for within the next seven days is that there's some type of atonement being brought into a situation. Um, Maybe you're not aware all of this is going on because you've been out here living in your own world, staying in your own bubble. Look, 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 look at this Queen of Cups. Minding her business in her own little world, not paying attention to anyone else. Okay? So, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpios, that is your read. I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Goodbye for now.